In this session, I'll cover the randomizing functions, the rand and rand between. What the well, let's start off with the rand function. What the rand function does is basically gives you a random number between zero and one. So we see here, we pressed it. We have this function here, and in order to get it running, uh, or to have it running each, to run the randomizing feature every time, you can just press the F9 key. So I press the F9 key, and you see we have different numbers that come up. Now let's say we want a value between maybe zero, uh, not 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 just between zero and one, maybe one and ten. Well, what we, what we need to do is then just multiply that by ten, and it will give us our random numbers between one and ten. And maybe we don't want um, a decimal number; we want uh, a whole number, an integer. Well, what we would need to do is basically round that number. So there is a round function. So in this video, we'll also introduce the round function. So you just type in round and select uh, that particular cell that has a decimal and the number of digits we just round it to the zero digits which will lop off those dig those uh, anything past the right of the decimal there and that will give us our whole number. Press F9 and you can see that we have it changed. Well let's say we don't want we want numbers between 0 and 100 all we need to do is multiply by 100 and press F9 and we will see that we have our numbers there now instead of doing these steps Excel 2007 gives us a ran between function which basically does it for us very nice so we go ahead and do the ran between type in ran between and select the bottom and top values so let's say for example we want a random number between 0 and 100, which is the bottom value of 0, top value of 100. Close the, um, close it with the close parentheses, and press enter. There we have it. 40 is between 0 and 100. Press F9, and we see our randomizing feature here. Very nice, cool function in Excel 2007. So you don't have to do these different steps here. Hope that helps. Thanks for watching.